Welcome back to my Let's Play for Well of Souls. And yeah, I was working on some Pokemon stuff earlier. I have to admit, didn't get as much done as I was hoping for, because I was working on Pokemon Ruby and got to Watson and realized, um, apparently it's going to take a lot more, um, stratagems than I thought to take him down with the bug team. Mostly because, you know, you get screwed over by, um, Supersonic. I do have a Shedinja, which is immune to, you know, all of his Magnemite's attacks. But at the same time, you know, if Shed Ninja gets confused, you know, it might knock itself out, so... I find myself a bit, you know, hampered by that, unfortunately. Though, right now, the only thing I can really think of doing right now is mostly focusing on raising my level. Um, we might focus on getting the Soul Horn a bit later, I mean, that is definitely something I can do. After all, this means we can use the Water Boots and make our way down to the Sea Kingdom. It's not usually my, um, highest priority, because let's face it, I don't really need a musical instrument in order to kick people's butts, but... It's definitely something to work on, you know, after I get another level or two in, probably. After that gets, you know, a little too boring. I can only handle so much level grinding at a time, after all. Especially nowadays, you know. It gets tedious, you know. I'm like spending hours just, you know, whacking away at an enemy. I suppose we can try, um, raising our strength here, though. Maybe that will improve our performance a little bit. Eh, not really. I guess with our strength maxed out, we really can't do anything with a raise to it. Darn. I was hoping that would work. Maybe if I stack it. Maybe that would help, you know? Like, I need more boofs. Nah, probably not. Well, come on, smack him hard. Ugh. Not Screech. Now I gotta worry about thing trying to take me out in a couple hits. Gosh darn it. Good thing it used that so late in the fight, or I may have been forced to consider retreating. And it's about time to actually head over to, um, everyone's other favorite town, to the nursery, to buy some more, um, wisdom raising eggs so I can get faster on participation points. But I've already picked up the spells I want, really. Um, Tame and Enchant. That way I'm, you know, set up to. Capture a Goblin Cowboy when we hit level 100. Okay. I'm going to continue to raise agility to raise that whole dodge option. Probably not going to happen too often for us, but hey. I can, you know, cross my fingers and hope, you know. Stupefy. Eh, whatever. I'm not a wizard. I don't care if you make me dumb. After all, it's not going to mess with my fists any. I mostly just want to have raised strength on here for Unravel. So it can also help with um, pets that you know haven't had their stats maxed out yet. Boom. Okay. Guess we don't really need the health berry. That fight was so quick and clean. I'm a bit surprised. Usually I'm not that lucky. But I wish they definitely had different combat music to play during this. Like how many times do I have to listen to you know the Mortal Kombat theme? Like Mortal Kombat! Like, there's nothing mortal about it, we're just pixels on a screen. And it's not like I can rip off the Revenge's head as a finisher, like, FINISH IT! And then sets head, you know, flying across the screen. You know, like, gotta have that hyper-violence in there. Well, let's continue to smack away. Ooh, a magnificent hit, nice. You gotta love a well-placed critical. Oh, please, Ice Age? What killed the dinosaurs? The Ice Age! That makes no sense, Arnold Schwarzenegger. I award you no points for your terrible one-liner. Because seriously, it doesn't make any sense, because we know what killed the dinosaurs. It was a giant space rock that slammed into um, a peninsula of Mexico. The Yucatan Peninsula? Yeah, that's it. It left a massive impact crater. Threw so much dust up in the air, it caused all the dinosaurs to die from the lack of heat. Killed all the vegetation from the lack of sun. Yeah, it was, it was uh, nasty. Well, I guess they can get some lucky hits in too. 6-6? Six, six. Oh no. I know it's really saying for 66,000 something, but... I see 6-6 six, six next to the other, and the first thing I have in mind is, you know, Order 66. The Extinction of the Jedi. I mean, I don't really care for, um, the Star Wars prequels too much, but I'm sure people can try and defend them. I've just never been all that interested in all the, um, 
wheels within wheels people try to come up with to excuse them. Okay, we'll throw another healing item on ourselves and move on. Okay, come on, let's whack him. Level 92, huh? Darn, I'm running out of wallet space. Well, let's hit him in the face. Come on. Gotta aim higher, cat. Aim between the eyes, you know? That's where you want to hit him with your staff. Nah, it's, it's not high enough. You hit him in the underbelly. I mean, that's not gonna really mess up a revenge. Okay. Let's take a break from killing things here. I mean, I can get another level up fairly quickly, but, you know, let's move on. Go hit up the nursery, I guess. Well, first things first, let's equip the, um... Frog boots. Sure, it'll slow us down, but let's walk on water so we can, you know, quickly cross this way. In order to make our way down to our target. You know what? Let's just head over to the Sea Kingdom. Or is this not it? No, it's the Sea Kingdom, alright. Okay. We'll work on that, um, whole, you know, soul horn thing, because why not? I suppose I can technically fight the pirates here, I just don't care. Now let's see. Yes, prison. Head jailer, huh? Yeah, yeah, whatever. And no one escapes from one of my cells. Okay, it happened once. Twice if you count both of them. They escaped together, so that's only once, man. That's what I'm calling it. Right? Anyway, uh, right vicious pair of criminals they were. Gotta say they're last seen heading west. I almost got fired over it. My wife was furious. One thing, she's never even seen Weston. So it got her that these criminals got to go. Oh, well, she was stuck here. I'm gonna have to work side jobs. Cheap labor, huh? Jeez. Well, obviously he's referring to our, um... Daphne friends, but he is lying about them being, um, wanted criminals. But this will help us get to Weston faster. So I'm taking it. Okay, Dolphins. I'm here to, you know, arrest you. What's wrong? What have you heard? Run! It's too late. Running won't save you. You vicious criminals, you! Well, there goes your friends. Yeah, I don't know the whole story, but we'll find the rest out later. Don't you mean she? Thanks for all your help. It's great to have those two back in their cells. They're good workers in my little side business as well. They have a way with fish. Yeah, they're not actually criminals. They actually are the... Um, king chefs. So, yeah. We gotta go talk to him to find out what we've done. He's gonna call us an idiot. Like, you idiot! They're my chefs! How dare you arrest them for that guy's side business? Yeah, I know. I could technically fight other stuff here. Yeah, yeah, I did. I'll say those... Looking the environment. All those electric zaps and zings. You'll smell funny as well, if you ask me. Definitely little fish. What's that? You captured dolphins? Those dolphins aren't criminals. They're gods. They're my private chefs. They're like SpongeBob, only better. Because they can move. Huh. Exquisite, huh? Yes, yes I will. You are, huh? Well, of course he doesn't. That's why he wanted the dolphins. Kind of killed them for the rubber boots, though. Yeah, they probably are. Yes, yes. Rescue the dolphins. And for doing this, he will give us the soul horn for fixing a problem we ourselves caused. Brilliant! Yeah, I know. It doesn't make much sense, does it? Like, I created the problem by arresting the wrong people. 
and then I, you know, get the rewards for fixing the issue. Yes, yes I have. Well, let's see if you're a match for me. And my guards! Jeez, trying to make me think of that cowardly, um... Guy in, um... Gosh, sorry. Men in tights. Mervin. The Sheriff of Nottingham. My biggest problem is this thing just gets in the way. Stun? Oh, no. Oh, good. It's too low of a level to affect me. Unless he did it. You know, he could probably stun me. Well, let's raise our strength back up. You can't affect me with that spell. You can only stun things that are lower level than yourself, so... While an awesome ability, you have to have, you know, high enough level to use it. Gosh darn it. You keep screwing with my attacks, Dad. Okay, let's take out this Dark Angel next. You know, one enemy at a time. <sighs> Guess I should use a healing item. Getting kind of weakened up here. Good thing he doesn't know poison, or I'd have to keep busting out the antidotes. And that's no fun. But this is why I haven't gone for the Soul Fist yet. Um, getting it requires you to go up against a bunch of enemies that are all really high level. Like, you have to go against, against like, five level 100 some enemies at one point. Which is a real pain, you know, when there's only um, one person there. It's one of those missions where you almost want to tackle it in a group, just to make it a bit easier. Yes, thank me. Yes, no more secrets. I don't know why he would. You did, huh? Yes, this humble reward for the problem you caused. Found it on the, in the back, but it looks important. I won't. I have absolutely no use for his soul horn. Um, yeah, I guess I could study music and, you know, wield it if I wanted to, but there's no real reason for that. Honestly, my real push at this point should be towards, um, the other town, though. Just get out of my way, Crocodile. I have to admit, I kind of like its look, though. I like the profile. You know, it's like it's barely out of the water, like it's trying to ambush you. Just cool. Damn, I hate wearing these shoes. Okay, can we switch back finally? Ugh. Being able to move faster is so nice. Like, you don't realize how much you miss having, you know, like the sole shoes until you're starting a new final you don't have them. Okay, let's see. The Wisdom of Canis, eh? Okay, we're broke again, but that's fine. We got what we wanted, a bunch of money. So, let's see. Where are we at, Seed? I assume it'd be somewhere in here. There it is. Like, I knew it was in this list somewhere. So, let's raise our stats by 35 points for free. Well, I guess it's not really free when you're paying, you know, 99,000, you know, gold pieces for a stat boost, but let's face it. I got the money while grinding, so it, it works out. Let's see, we actually get some tickets home. Do I have one of those? Oh yeah, I do. Okay. I want to use this and head over to MacGyver's Castle and see if there's any new hunt missions. We can hopefully get some cheap level ups, you know, without having to work my butt off. Because if I can get some free, you know, levels, you know, like go up plus two, I'll only have to hunt down some minor enemies, I, I wouldn't mind. It'd be, it'd be sweet, you know? Realm of Ruins, huh? Okay. I will accept the mission, and hot stuff, huh? You gotta have a certain fire danger removed. Lava Jelly, Devil Fork. Okay. 
No, no, I still want that mission. I didn't realize I accepted that. Well, now. Guess we're gonna have to go hunt down some more lava jellies. And devil forks. I know where the Ethereons are at, though. They're pretty big and hard to miss. So we're first gonna have to get back to where we were. I wanna hunt those. I might stop by in the Maze of Eternity first, anyway. At least I think that's over here somewhere. Hmm. Actually, I think I can hunt down lava jellies over here in the Inferno. And then I can head over to the ruins on down devils. Okay. Stupid lava jelly. How dare you take more than one hit from myself. Ugh, denying my glorious power. Well, whatever. It happens. Seriously? Fire? I mean, I know it's a volcano, but come on, can you be more obvious about it? And why does a goblin knight wield fire anyway? Does this look like something that should wield a lot of firepower? Ooh, three of them. Ooh, an instant kill. At least they drop these lava chills pretty often. I, I do like that aspect, because it makes hunting them down quickly a little bit easier. Okay, just a couple more. Ah, darn, that one wasn't so nice. Eh, that's not gonna work. I got too many levels over you, dummy. Can't use that on me. Ah, shoot. Four enemies? Well, we're gonna be here for a while. Numb? Uh, who am I hitting now? I have no idea who I'm targeting. Okay, this is the other lava jelly. Gotcha. Darn, only four? So many more to go. Oh well, probably heal after this fight. Come on, Batclops, just die. I know, I know, we're not gonna get anything useful out of the Batclops, but... Without a clear idea where the ranges are at, it's hard to, you know... Get just lava jellies in here. If I could see, you know, where their, um... Ranges are, I could avoid, you know, other enemies while on these hunts. Okay. Practically right on top of it, so hopefully I'll get lucky and get... Oh, yeah, I was hoping I'd get three for them. Well, hopefully get at least one, right? I hate when you go hunting for stuff like this and you get nothing for your efforts. Like, that's always the worst feeling. Like, you killed something and you got nothing. Like, joy. Okay, come on. Let me hit it again. Ugh, come on, give me another cone, will ya? Darn denied. Why do they move around so much? Oh, not poison. Oh, good, it failed. I hate poison. I don't want to, have to learn antidote, you know, because as far as spells go, I'd rather not have to have that one. But sorting through my inventory takes way too long if I have to go looking for antidotes. Just, ugh. I suppose I could quick map it. I usually end up in situations where it's strictly necessary, usually. Well, we got at least two in here, so I'll stick around. Come on. We're gonna have to split this hunt mission up into two parts, aren't we? Just because I'm not gonna finish this before, you know, I wanna call it quits on this episode. Can I at least find all the cylinders? Or whatever from the lava jellies? And I assume I wanna look for the big devils for the forks. Well, almost finished maxing out that stat. Come on. Reveal to me your lovely rewards. 
Come on, just two more. Come on, team. Be generous. Sweet. One more to go. And this one's not going to be nice. Of course not. <sighs> one more. Come on. Just one more. I just need some Coney goodness. Ah, darn it. Denied. Come on, I want to use your cones for snow cones. Darn it. Okay, try this again. Well, four of them? Well, almost guarantee we'll get here. I hope. Come on. The only amount of spell fire we're gonna take is gonna blow, because spells take forever to land in this game. Like, damn it, game! Stop wasting my time on the animations here. Okay, you try lowering my defenses, huh? Denied again? Come on, just give it to me. Give it to me, you son of a gun. Seriously? I mean, I'll fight four of these things and be denied. Oh man. I mean, come on. Four? And I couldn't get it? Like, I figured at least one of them would give me, you know, the part I needed. Finally. That's what I'm talking about. Well, we got an extra one, but whatever. Okay. I assume this is what I'm looking for right here. I would assume the little devil has what I want. Yep, Devil Forks, okay. I mean, I call it quits here. Next time we'll continue our hunt for Devil Forks, then make way over to the ruins to hopefully finish up the other one, get, you know, most of the levels we're missing to hit, you know, max. Because I'd like to, you know, get to level 99 and start being able to do work on the other quests. Until next time, then. See ya.